What's up guys? So I've had a bunch of people ask me to do some YouTube videos just to show what I do with my car, how I build it, and the process of doing that. So figured I'd start off with a build update, see where we're at, and then where we're gonna go. So I just got the car back from GT Custom. Shout out to Matt and the guys there. They did an unreal job on all this fab work. Recently just done the intercooler piping, expansion tank, coolant overflow, added a muffler, absolutely came out flawless looks awesome as you can see the interior here is nowhere near done we have some pretty cool stuff that's going to be happening here we have the boost gauge which has a custom plate mounted in the vent area here we have a custom mounting portion over here for the meth controller um, we have a custom plate that got 3d printed and then made out of metal as well for the air lift uh, controller um, and then we're gonna add some mirrors up here, some LED lighting, and we'll make it look pretty awesome in here. So as you can see in the trunk, this is also nowhere near complete. Uh, we do have our meth hooked up um, in relation to the supports that are built. We have to do the wiring here. We have done a lot of custom work in the trunk to include for the battery setup. We've decided to run a double Odyssey uh, PC680 battery system just to help it a little bit. I'm, you don't really need the two, but I figured overkill is always better. That's why I'm running the dual compressors as well. Um, we are going to be doing a trunk setup in here. Nothing too crazy because I do eventually want to put a half cage in it, but we are going to be doing that as a video YouTube as well. Some pretty awesome components about this car is that it is a full chassis mounted seven point diffuser here um, i'm not going to lie this is more of a visual component than anything else but it does look pretty awesome as you can see we have the various wide body kit on this car we will be making some custom side skirts for this thing just to ensure that they are again chassis mounted complete overkill but that's the way i like to build this car Track setup for this car are running uh, 265 35-18s on an RPF1, 10.5 plus 15, and also a work set of CR2Ps for the show setup. As you can see, there's still going to be lots of custom stuff made for this car, which I'm pretty excited about, and we'll be doing YouTube videos when we build the stuff like the custom rad shroud and the trunk setup and all the gauges and stuff like that. So if you like what you've seen so far, like, subscribe. See you soon.